Hey everyone, I hope you all are doing well. So here is a first look at the OnePlus 10 Pro in real, however let me inform you that it is a dummy unit displayed at a China store, although it is a nearly identical to the original phone. We are only few days away from the phone's launch date, we have seen the official teaser of the device and now the phone's dummy unit, which gives us an idea of how the actual phone will look in person. A tipster on leak shared this video on Twitter, and to be honest I don't like the rear panel design that OnePlus has used on the 10 Pro. Instead of a square shape, they should have gone with a landscape-like design like Google. I believe the reason is that once the OnePlus and Oppo brands joined, Oppo modified the Oxygen OS to be similar to the color OS, which disappointed the majority of customers including myself. The rear panel of the OnePlus 10 Pro may have been designed by Oppo because it resembles the Oppo's F17 back design, which also includes a square shaped camera house. Furthermore, OnePlus is preparing for the launch and the phone stores have begun to promote it. Returning to the back design, the flash unit is attracting a lot of attention this time. It appears weird because this type of flash unit was seen in the Google's Nexus 6 back in 2014. This is a significant change from the vertical camera bump on the OnePlus 9 Pro to a square shaped camera hum. We can also see the phone in a photo shoot which could be the commercial shots for use in advertisements. In this image we can see the phone in black. I also have some fresh images of the complete device that shows the design in a greater detail. Aside from the design, the features of the OnePlus 10 Pro are interesting. It will include a 6.7 inches QHD Plus LTPO display screen with a 120Hz refresh rate. It will also include a 5000 mAh battery that supports both 80W Superbook charging and 50W Airbook charging for reverse charging. Of course, it will also have a Snapdragon 8 Gen 1 CPU. There will be a 3 camera on the back of the phone, two of the sensor features resolution of 48MP and 50MP, while the third has a 8MP resolution. The camera software will be modified by Hazelblade because OnePlus has a Hazelblade collaboration. The OnePlus 10 Pro also includes a 32MP selfie camera on the front which is a welcome change from the 16MP sensor. We have to wait and watch at what price OnePlus will release the devices. If it wants to be known as a flagship killer, the company should price the phone aggressively. Because speculations are calculating that the OnePlus may lose the flagship killer name tag. What are your thoughts on the design of this phone and the flash you need? Do share your thoughts in the comment section below. With that said, subscribe if you like and I will see you in the next one.